that there's a lot of people who want to go into nursing and uh, it's, it's an exciting area, but it's also really challenging, right? When, when, when it comes to the classes, uh, was there a really tough class for you and, and how did you get through it? I think the biggest challenge that I faced thus far was hitting this wall of kinesiology. Um, I think it was the first class, it's, it's called kinesiology 223, and it's like anatomy and physiology part one, because you do have to take two of those classes a lot of the times. And coming from high school, and honestly, all of my academic career prior to college, it was like, you're a gifted kid, you're doing great, you have straight A's all the time. And then when I come to this class, it's so much more overwhelming than what I had been prepared for previously. And I had to get at least a B in the class and I ended up with a B minus. So just being so close and not making it and failing for the first time was a really hard realization for me, honestly. So getting a B minus wasn't enough? It isn't. You're supposed to get an A, but a B is bare minimum because you can only retake the classes twice. And so without that B minimum, that B minus stays on your record. So you are someone who is used to getting A's? Definitely, yeah. A straight A student in high school? Through high school, yes. And through, I would say, the first year, year and a half of college as well, as I took a lot of my prerequisites and such. But that was a class that I needed. <laughs> Right. So when you are in this class and you get a B minus, which is essentially failing for that particular class, how are you able to pick yourself up and continue to move forward? I think many of us, but very much specifically myself, is that we try to put ourselves in these perfect boxes where it's like, I'm going to graduate in four years and I'm just going to get exactly where I want to be within the next four years. And for me to fall off of that track was very difficult, but it's it's just realizing that you're on your own path. Everyone's going through their own things and this is just what happened to me. And I just have to keep going, retake the class because that's exactly what I can do and what I have to do to continue to get to my goal. And I did end up working with the same professor and I was honestly very shy to go to her office hours, but she's so kind and so great. And even if she wasn't as great, it was just something necessary that I had to do. And I ended up getting an A, thankfully, um, the second time around, but it did just have to take the try again. 